Today, I am doing an extreme slime makeover of my very own store-bought slime. Me? Making over my very own slime? You heard that correctly. You guys know I have a podcast. It's linked down below. It's Nicole Jacklin podcast. I post new episodes every single Friday. My slime shop is restocked and it is linked down below. It's slimebyjacklin.com. Hey you guys, what is up? And welcome back to a brand new video. Yes, it is me. I just got back from a photo shoot and I look like this. I know, right? What? <laughs> but today we are doing an extreme slime makeover of my slimes from Target, my Compound Kings Butter Scoop Slime Collab, available exclusively at Target. If you wanna find these, they are only available in store at Target. You have to go get them because they're actually so freaking cute. If I should do a part two extreme slime makeover of my slime from Target, give this video to 2,000 thumbs up if I should do an extreme slime makeover of my slimes from Target, but it has to get 2,000 thumbs up in the first five days of uploading and I will post part two of my extreme slime makeover of my slimes. I have an exciting announcement. On February 20th at 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, I'm hosting a slime making workshop over Zoom. It's only $35 for a one hour workshop with me. You can make slime with me. I'll be sending you a list of ingredients before the workshop. I will answer your questions about having a slime business, literally everything and anything in between. Just so you guys know, you can officially pre-order my how to start a slime shop video guide right now in my store. It is only $29. It's essentially like a super long YouTube video filled with tutorials and just it's super informational about how to start a successful slime shop. I'm giving you all of my secrets and it's only $29. Link down below. Once you pre-order it, you will receive an email explaining how you will receive your pre-order on February 27th when it comes out officially. And of course, I will have my slime shop down below for you guys. Go and check it out. And yes, you guys, let's hop into Extreme Slime Makeover Part 1 of my Compound Kings Butter Scoop Slime available exclusively at Target in-store. <laughs> Okay, you guys, the first slime I am making over is this really cute little smoothie slime. So in the Butter Scoops collection, there are two ice creams, a popsicle, and a smoothie Butter Scoop slime. They are miniature butter slimes, and they are so fun. They come with little add-ins on the inside. So this one came with little pom-poms and bingsu beads and a mystery charm. So once I got the slime out of the container, I was trying to decide the direction I wanted to go. Go with this because I honestly love how these slimes look. I love the colors. They're so beautiful. But as you guys know, when you mix neon colors together, you are going to get brown more than likely. So I was trying to figure out how we can kind of recreate these slimes back in their original forms, except making them much larger and much more intricate. And honestly, just getting like more slime out of it. So I actually ended up getting this all mixed together. You can see that little buttery scoop vibe. And then I added in some white base. I actually pre-made some white base to add into my slimes because it is just like the easiest way to do this, honestly. So once I had mixed the base into the butter scoop slime, I got that all mixed up. Added a little bit of activator because sometimes when you add um, a base to a clay, it tends to kind of slightly melt it down a little bit. So I added in some activator as well as some of this beautiful hot pink clay. I love this color. I think it is so gorgeous. You guys know I love my neon colors so much and it kind of offsets the brown and kind of creates this like strawberry color, which I think is really pretty and very Valentine's Day themed. And I just loved that. So so once I had created the base here, I actually decided to add in some of my favorite type of beads. They are the marshmallow beads. I love these. I was just getting like some major Valentine's Day popcorn vibes and I was like, okay, let's try to like keep some sort of like a theme here. 
So I kind of went down the Valentine's Day route. Please comment down below a name for this slime because I love how this looks so far. And we're not done yet. So I added that into a jar. And then I decided to top it off with some of these heart-shaped sprinkles. And by the way, I do sell these in my in my slime shop. It's linked down below. They are called heart Fimo slices or heart sprinkles. Um, they are so fun. So then I decided to top this off with some little clear slime that I dunked into some miniature little sprinkles to kind of, you know, give the vibe of a like a strawberry syrup of sort. I was kind of getting like big popcorn cupcake vibes. And then I decided to add on the toppings from when I originally opened up my butter scoop slime. And then I love to kind of just like top it off with what I was originally given. And how cute is this little bunny charm? I think it is so precious. So what do you guys think? I think this is kind of like a crazy makeover considering what we started with, like where we're at now, how it started versus how it's going. I know, kind of drastic. I love how this looks so much. And if you guys do any kind of extreme slime makeover to my butter scoops, please tag me. I challenge you guys to do that. And if enough of you guys do it, I will film a reaction video on YouTube where I react to you guys doing makeovers of my butter scoops slimes only at Target. So definitely check that out. And make sure you guys give it a thumbs up if you want me to do a part two because I would love to do more of these. So then next I moved over to my ice cream butter scoop slime. And in this video, I'm only making over two of the four. So if you guys want that other one, definitely give it a thumbs up. But I loved this ice cream vibe and I was trying to kind of keep these unicorn ice cream vibes going. So once I took the slime out of the package and I separated the sprinkles all the, all the add-ins. Then I got this slime all mixed up, have this, you know, I know, very exquisite brown. Not gonna lie though, like my favorite slimes tend to be um, beige, brown, taupe. I don't know what it is, but it's like my favorite color. Um, so I'm just going in here and I'm adding in some of this beautiful green clay and adding in some of the activator that I had on my desk actually from Elmer's. I love the metallic one because it adds a cool little shine to the slime. And then I decided to, kind of in the theme of the ice cream trend, add some of this bright orange clay on top. And then I designed a little ice cream light like fondant topping here with my nail. I just like drew some kind of natural scoop designs, if you will. And then I decided to take some of my hot pink clay and put it into my unicorn mold and I created a little unicorn head of clay. I topped it off with the sprinkles that my butter scoop slime came with, which I thought was a really fun little addition. I took the remainder of my base and I put that on top, a nice little drizzle. And then I topped it off with my neon sprinkles that I sell in my shop as well. They are just called neon sprinkles. And I think this looks so good. I forgot to add the charm in that came with my butter scoop slime. And I did not add in the bingsu beads this time. But I have them for next time, which is a really fun little addition. Um, but yes, love how this turned out. And you guys are going to die at the end color. It's so pretty. Like giving me big face mask vibes. And I just love that very beautiful, muddy green, like mud mask. I think it's the coolest color in the world. Um, kind of dramatic, but you know me, if you know, you know. So yes, that is the end result for this slime. If I should do more of these makeovers, you guys, 2000 thumbs up in the first five days of posting and I will do it for you guys. Like I am crossing my fingers because that would be so fun. And if you guys do any extreme slime makeovers of my butter scoops, please record yourself doing it and post it on YouTube or TikTok even. And I will film a reaction video on my channel very soon. All right, you guys, if I should do a part two of my extreme slime makeover of the brand new Compound Kings Butter Scoop Slimes, get this video to 2,000 thumbs up in the first five days of posting. And if that happens, I'm gonna do a part two of my extreme slime makeover edition 
videos. You guys always love these, so I'm like, let's freaking go. And of course, I will have my video guide for you guys down below to pre-order. And yes, definitely go snatch it because it is such a iconic guide and I am so freaking proud of it, you guys. Y'all are going to be so shook. Like this is a very informational guide and I'm working on creating a bunch of other video courses that you can order just like this one that will come out in the next few months. So stay tuned. Honestly, I am so excited. And I will have my slime shop down below for you guys to go and check out. And if I should do a part two, 2,000 thumbs up and I got you guys. So yes, you guys, I will see you guys in the next video and hopefully it'll be the part two extreme slime makeover like this video. It would mean the freaking world. And I'll see you guys in the next one. All right, guys, bye, love ya. I have an exciting announcement. On February 20th at 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, I'm hosting a slime making workshop over Zoom. It is only $35 for a one hour workshop with me. You can make slime with me. I'll be sending you a list of ingredients before the workshop. I will answer your questions about having a slime business, literally everything and anything in between.